With the new development of the scan light source QualiDot, a new era in analog plate exposure has now begun. The numerous innovations of the device have ensured crucial progress in flexo plate making. The following illustrations, microscopic cross section, and surface shots clearly illustrate the individual features of this qualitative advancement. The modified imaging with the QualiDot DR leads to considerably steeper dot shoulder angles. A reduction of the dot printing surface is the result of targeted exposure. The negative elements are more open as well as the shadow tones in the halftone area. The result is better printing quality and less machine stops. The UV light under 350 and over 400 nanometers is cut by means of a duplex filter. The area coverage of the dots from flexo and letterpress plates can be changed by exposure with a reduction filter. Each QualiDot exposure unit has a duplex and reduction filter to increase the scope of the exposure latitude. The illustration on the left hand side shows the result with a tube exposure unit. The right one shows the result with QualiDot. Clearly sharper shoulder angles and considerably improved washing out depths can be seen. The following illustrations show the imaging processes with a tube exposure unit. The photopolymer plate is shown in orange. The UV tubes are in blue. First we see the plate with the negative on it. Then the starting of the exposure process. After that, the start of the polymerization. This illustration shows the polymerization through to the floor, the formation of the shoulder angles. And this one shows the increased formation of the shoulder angles. The printing result with the tube exposure shows an increase of the tonal value from highlight to shadow. This illustration shows the result of an overexposure. The consequence of an overexposure with the tube exposure unit will be again a considerable increase in tonal values starting in the shadow area. With the QualiDot exposure process, targeted UV energy reaches the film negative without any scattered light. The illustration shows the beginning of the polymerization. In these two illustrations you will see polymerization through to the floor. In this illustration the formation of the shoulder angles is shown. The difference between the tube exposure unit and the modern QualiDot device can be seen clearly. The printing result after a QualiDot exposure process is much better, as you can see. Now we would like to look over the shoulders of an operator of a QualiDot exposure. All flexo printing plates can be cut to size with a new plate cutter in an easy and precise way up to a thickness of 7 millimeters. The operator will now carry out a back exposure of a printing plate at the QualiDot. After having placed the flexo plate on the vacuum bed, he will cover the complete area with a vacuum foil. He will adjust the exposure time via the speed. After that, the start button is pressed. Ten seconds later, the button is pressed a second time. In doing so, back exposure is activated. The wavelength needed for the polymerization is realized with a metal halogen lamp.
the image process being finished, the vacuum foil transfer roller can be moved back. The operator will now turn the plate over and remove the cover sheet for the following main exposure process. Now the film negatives can be applied. Since the QualiDot was marketed, Flexo printing with analog printing plates has come very near to the quality of digitally exposed plates. The operator lays the silver structure strips around the plates so that a vacuum can be created faster, also keeping the vacuum foil clean. The vacuum foil having been pulled over the plate with the transfer roller, the vacuum can be started. A control instrument shows the vacuum build up. The operator will now store the imaging time at the KR computer under a program number. By entering the separate time, the exposure time is also stored. The exposure process begins with the start command. The length of the remaining exposure time can be continuously seen on the display. The analog exposure technology was upgraded to the highest quality class by the innovations of the QualiDot scan light source system. The modular housing concept, the single light source, and the new patented cooling system are some of the special features. The good results are a consequence of all these innovations. Shorter exposure times, reduced scattering light, steeper flanks, and improved intermediate depths. Another new feature is the permanent UVA output control, which ensures increased safety in exposure. The operator will now carry out an exposure process with reduction foil, which he pulls over the vacuum foil. Then he will start the vacuum pump. Before exposure, the time will have to be pre-selected again. Then the process can be started. After the warm-up time, the UV lamp runs across the format until the preset time is over, as with all other exposure processes. The exposure scope is enlarged by reduction foil. By this exposure method, the dots of flexo and letterpress plates can be changed by the targeted exposure. The exposure time is finished. The masking strips as well as the negatives can be removed. The exposed flexo plate is fed into the plate processor. In order to carry out an exposure process of digital plates without any vacuum foil, the vacuum foil reel is put into the foil carriage. By lifting the catch lever, the reel can be released and put into the foil carriage. This change is easy to handle as well, as you can see. Exposing digital printing plates, no vacuum foil is used. 
This way, a considerably improved dot structure without any scattering light is realized. The plate is fixed with metal stripes. The vacuum is switched on with the vacuum button and the separate vacuum switch is switched to off. The exposure of the digital plates can be started. During the exposure, a high amount of UV energy acts upon the digital plate. The digital printing plates are exposed and are now removed. In order to change the metal halogen lamp, the operator will have to open the lamp housing and pull off the upper reflector stripe. The tube itself is released from two receptacles for taps. The lamp housing is closed again with a covering. All parts of the QualiDot are arranged in a user-friendly way. Access to the lateral slide-in compartment for the duplex filter can be gained easily, as you can see. The stability of the flexo plate can be considerably increased with the new QualiDot scan light source and its other advantages, such as even temperature, constant focused UV output, and improved polymerization. The high quality of the QualiDot will certainly convince you as well.